much, Roger. Carrie Hall joining us. And Carrie, we have decided you cannot use the phrase wintry mix until November at the earliest. Okay, well, I'll find another word for <laughs> stuff that we'll be moving through as we head into the next couple of days. So right now, as we take a look, a look out at Norwalk after starting the morning with snow, we had a little bit of a break with the sunshine breaking out early afternoon. Now you can see the clouds have rolled back in and there will still be a chance of some light sprinkles as we go through the rest of the evening. We're seeing that farther off towards the east and then as we look even farther to the east, we're tracking our next weather maker that will be here later on tomorrow. So as that continues to move in, our temperatures will be dropping too. So today we got up to, if you can believe it, after starting out with those flurries, 47 degrees in Bridgeport, 50 degrees in New Canaan, and that will still a couple of degrees cooler than where we should be. But I think we'll take it as we go into this forecast. We're still going to be going up and down as we go through the rest of the week. Here's what happens as we go into tomorrow. So I won't say it, I'll just put it on the screen rain <laughs> snow mix as we go into tomorrow that starts during the evening commute not expected to bring much in the way of accumulation and some of us will only see the flurries before that all moves on and it will be clearing out by late on Wednesday so now we are looking at lows tonight down to 30 degrees in Bridgeport and tomorrow will be another day pretty much like today reaching 44 degrees except we'll have the mix on the tail end of the day and then as we go through the week it warms up about 62 degrees on Friday. That looks great, but Easter cools down a few degrees, but at least it will be sunny. There's more hyperlocal weather coming up in a few minutes.